Hi guys, welcome back to Chicken One Creations. We are continuing the work on our little fox. Last time we got the white on most of his belly here and we did some color around his legs and got his tail done. Today we're gonna start working on putting the fur on his back. I'm gonna wait and do his head last. So I'm going to, because if you look at your fox, the hair around his legs is really quite short. So I'm going to kind of leave that and I'm going to start, you know, probably up a little bit. But I'm going to go back. So I'm going to start here and work my way forward. So we're going to do the same technique that we did for the, um, for the belly. Um, I'm going to put it on, um, stab it through the middle and then fold it in half and stab it down. I really like how his, how his tail came out here. So I'm going to blend some colors up here a little bit and see what we get. Probably just throw this up on fast speed and I will get back to you when I have something to share. What I want to do, looking at the picture here, um, these hind quarters kind of built up a little bit more than what I have here. Um, well, actually, I'm not going to because the fur is going to kind of cover that up anyway, so never mind.
I guess I need to take a hair cutting course. <laughs> Poor guy. So, um, I happened to see a video this weekend on um, how to keep your fur from matting as you're working on it. And one of the suggestions was to not work on a little surface, but on a more shiny surface. Um, and since I'm working on a thick, a thick surface here, I don't have to worry about stabbing into, you know, anything. And so what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to shove this out of the way here. And I'm just going to work on my, my surface here. So it's a slicker surface. And hopefully I can do this with, um, I might need to actually... What I might do is just kind of maybe prop it up on this. I hope you can still see this. <laughs> Move my stuff out of the way here. So hopefully I'll stay in the frame. I apologize if I get out of the frame, but I will see if I can work this on this side now. This is a, I have a hard time working on this side as it is, so we'll see how it goes.
Alrighty. So I think we're going to stop that here and I don't want to get too far up here because I want to get his, his ears and what have you on first um, before I finish the rest of his back. So I think we will stop here. I have to figure out, I have to go watch a video on how to give a wool buddy a haircut. So if you have any recommendations on a link or anything, send them my way in the comments below and we'll see what we can come up with on the next video. So we will we'll tackle his face, his head on the next video and see what we can get accomplished. Um, this is taking a lot longer than I thought it would. But we'll see if we can keep his head from getting too huge like the last one did. So, all right. So until the next time, I will see you. Have yourself a good day and we will see what we can get accomplished in the next video. Thanks for watching. Take a minute and subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. And we'll see you next time. Thanks.